runs. Oh, oh, ah! Open sesame? Whoa! Oh, God. Don't you know what today is, Ren? It's Tuesday, the 17th. Wow! The unluckiest day of the year. And you found a little bit. Look. You told me. Now we go into the DMV. Hopefully, this will go away. They turned us away. Basically, they open at 7 o'clock, but they expect you to be here at 6.30. On some other news, my shoes are pretty cool. Look at those. Black and gold Timberlands. I think that's true, too. I know the, the, the idea that you're working with here, you got to be your best possible self. Mm -hmm. And I think it's important to figure out at the beginning of that journey, what does that look like? What do you want your best possible self to be? Like... Are you talking like, I want to be, you know, an Arnold Schwarzenegger jacked type of thing? Like, are you, are you looking for, you know, to be big and strong? Is that your best possible self? Or is your best possible self a person who spends time with people that they love more? Or is the best possible version of you the one who spends time learning about things you want to learn about? What, is that, what does that look like? Because having that goal, understanding for yourself what is the person you want to be, I think, clarifies a lot. So, let's talk. But don't worry, I won't keep you for very long. I was talking to an acquaintance of mine, and she asked me a question. And her question was, is it wrong for me to want people to worship me? And you know what I told her? I said, no, it's not wrong for you to want that. It's wrong for you to want that if you're not the kind of person that deserves to be worshiped. If you want people to treat you a certain way, you need to embody that thing that you are expecting them to treat you as. If you want people to treat you like a king or a queen, you need to behave like a king or a queen. You have to always be on your P's and Q's and you have to be responsible and you have to be respectable. Because if you're not those things, why the heck should anybody treat you like a queen? If you want someone in your life who's going to be awesome, you want an awesome boyfriend or girlfriend, an awesome partner in your life, and you yourself need to be awesome. Understand that if you want good things to come to you, be someone who deserves good things to come to them. The world's unfair for every single person and living creature, and that is exactly what makes it fair. I agree. Positive self-talk Tuesday. Positive self-talk. The king's out here. Bitch, you what? What? Hey. Hey. Stop. Stop. Back up. What? Look, guys. Bus. So, who is living here? Come over here. I dare you. Well, let's investigate. It doesn't look like anybody's been up here for a while. These guys are a bunch of goofballs. Well, let's go see if anybody's home. It says in big red text, runs. It looks abandoned, but I don't know that. Hello? Oh, wow. Look at that really creepy painting in there. You guys see that? That's ah, spooky. The only logical thing to do would be to go to the front door and see if anybody's home before I go snooping around. <laughs> In my personal opinion, I just don't think anybody's home. Hmm. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get ourselves a spider stick. A spider stick is just a, a big old stick like this, you know, take off all the, 
special doohickeys. And then when you go into something like an area that could possibly house many, many spiders, you kind of just do like this, you know? Like just wave around all in here. Because what that does is if there's any unknown spider webs in here, well this, this will take care of all of that. You know? That way there's no special surprises, you know, for anybody like myself in here. They say it runs. Now, I'm just gonna say, me personally, I don't think it runs. But, we don't know that. So, you know, I guess I'll take a seat. Now that I'm doing this channel where I'm gonna have you guys around me for pretty much the entire year, you guys are gonna see me do some Jaden Jaden activities. This is what I do. I would say to you guys, unless you guys have a lot of experience, don't do things like this at home, okay? Because listen, listen, there could be poisonous animals, poisonous insects, there could be creatures. If you get attacked by a honey badger, you know, that's that's pretty much game over for you. You're gonna have a really tough time. You might not die, but you're, you're not gonna be happy. And there could be people here as well. There could be a, a serial axe murderer inside that house. And if you're not a person like me who can just get up and run really fast, that might cause some problems for you. Whew. All right, so it's been here for quite some time. Look at that, they've got uh, one of those nest things on there, I don't know. I'm just not afraid because I'm crazy. It ain't working. Fast idle, raise, platform, lower, pass signal, stow. You got the defrost right here. Function, is there like a place for a key? Let's see, what's that? Battery. All right. All right. I've never sat behind the driver's seat of a bus before, but I guess there's always a first. Look at that, they've got rear view mirrors. All right, diagnose bus test, bulb test. Nope. Fast idle. Ah, geez. Okay, so that broke. I think they should scratch off the thing where it says runs because guys I'm gonna be honest with you She don't run so let's head around back There's tons of cool stuff now. We could go inside the house, but I don't know if that's such a good idea But if we're gonna go inside we should probably do it now because it's gonna get dark soon And I don't want to be here in the dark. Luckily. I wore my Explorer shoes today. How would you open this? Oh look at that Water. Why? Now guys, I'm not, a, I'm not a vehicle mechanic, but I do love vehicles. I love vehicles, they're awesome to me. Huh. I don't even know what that, huh. Uh. Oh, look at that. Ow. What's that, engine oil. Do not use multi viscosity oil. I don't know what that means, guys, but I'm guessing the engine oil goes in there. Converter. Ooh, hello. Ooh. Ah. Now that, my friends, that's liquid. This appears to be the transmission. Or, or no, 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 no. That clearly says converter oil. Yeah. So let's put that back. I really just want to open the whole thing. Oh. Oh. Ah. Oh, -ho! all right, well, you know, open sesame. Whoa, what's that sound? I hear dripping. I don't know where the dripping is coming from, but there's definitely dripping. Hmm, what's that? Oh, it's a twisty. Steering fluid. Oh, there's, there's some fluid in there. What's this? Let's dip. Oh, God. Ugh. Yuckers. 
Gross. Gross, dude. And I wish there was a way to get it to do something. Like to even get it to turn over, you know what I mean? That'd be freaking awesome. I don't even know how I'd, where I'd begin. Because I don't know where the ignition is. Or I think, like, whatever ignition that there was is destroyed. Guys, this is a dream come true. Whoa, whoa, what's this? Okay, so right here we've got a freaking plug. What the heck does a bus need a plug for? So guys, any any motorheads out there down in the comments, can you tell me what the heck the, there's a plug going straight to, from the bus in, in there? It's in there. There's got to be something in here. Some way to get it to do a thing. Because, I mean, once upon a time, she ran. You know what I mean? So, guys, should we go inside the house? I'm going to leave that up to you guys, actually. I'm going to leave that totally up to you. Because, listen, guys, listen, guys. This is as much... Honda. I'm gonna leave it completely up to you guys. You guys let me know in the comments section to go inside the house. The next video, you'll be going and exploring what's inside the house, okay? All right, well, let's pack it up.